Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to set shop page in your WordPress WooCommerce. First of all guys, I will need you to go to your WordPress website and then open the dashboard. Which is pretty simple, go to wordpress.com slash WP admin or just like me, localhost slash slash WordPress slash WP admin. After that, you only need to log in and this shall be opened. Now, in order for you to have WooCommerce, you can go to here plugins add a new, search for plugins and type here WooCommerce with double O. After that, click here to install now and then wait for it until it's fully installed and then click on active to activate it. After we finish with this step, I need you to go to install plugins, go to active and search if they exist over here. So here it is WooCommerce, here it is WooCommerce payment. So both uh, plugins are here. Now, when you finish with this step, you will notice that you have some like, uh, menu that have been added to your main menu so here we have woocommerce products payments analytics marketing so here if i refresh they will still be here there so here for example here you find woocommerce orders exports orders customers coupons etc and here you'll find your product and so on so there's nothing here that actually gives you the page of store well how you can get the page of store which is pretty simple guys you don't really have to add the page of store to your website because when you install the WooCommerce it will be directly added to your website so for example here if I went to pages you will find this the soap page is has has been already created so if I click here on view here it is and these are the products that I have in it of course if you want to open it directly from your website without going to here you can click it from here so user blocks or whatever the name of your website click on visit store and here it is so yeah, guys that's pretty simple you don't really have to do anything to add a shop store or a store page or etc you just have to click in here and you will find it so it is there guys created by default so yeah guys that was it for today's video if you enjoyed it, please leave a like and thank you guys for watching